a mad scramble in the middle of Lithgow. In this onslaught, a garden hose was the best weapon they had as the monster from the Blue Mountains roared down the range. Immediately, family homes went up, a town of more than 20,000 under a brutal ember attack. Jesus. Um, I, I'm very afraid for all of us. Police turning firefighters to try to save their community. The streets, fires just popped up out of nowhere. And before you knew it, another house was engulfed. Once one fire was out, another had already started. This mining town having its metal severely tested. Uh, trying to do something that's probably impossible. They told us it would be catastrophic, and on cue, the Gospers Mountain mega fire woke up. And there is a heightened risk of a fire-generated thunderstorm. In Bilpin, firefighters walked into the gates of hell. Scorching heat and gusty winds, a mixture for mayhem. For our already weary fire crews, conditions don't get worse than this. The blaze that's hounded communities on the city's southwest outskirts pushed into the town of Hilltop. A new target for this hungry fire. If it gets too close, we're out of here. They knew it was coming. It's not far. But it's hard to prepare for this. I just don't want no one to get hurt. Further south, just off the humid Yerenbull, platoon of fire trucks were ready for the flames to run up the hill. Towns throughout the Blue Mountains faced a fight. This house was no chance. The community of Bell was dwarfed by the smoke, crews doing the best they could. Flames got close to the famous apple orchards in Bilpin. On the ground, it was just as gobsmacking. The scale of this bushfire emergency is hard to get your head around. The view from the Nine News helicopter, zero visibility, showing how hard it is to fight the fire from the air too. It's a shocking start to the Christmas break. Sydney is virtually barricaded in by road. There's no way to get over the Blue Mountains. With both the Great Western Highway and Bell's line of road shut in both directions, the train line blocked at Mount Victoria as well. The Hume Highway is closed between Sutton Forest and Norellan, and so is Picton Road. Today is not the day to start your holiday. There has never been a deployment of emergency service workers this large ever before. An extra 250 trucks, which is about another 1,000 firefighters, are stood up and deployed. But such is the sheer size of these fire fronts, they can't be everywhere. You can't guarantee that you're going to get a fire truck. 500 elderly have been evacuated from Blue Mountains nursing homes. Hospitals are on standby with paramedics under the pump. The busiest season on record for this organisation. RFS is warning the two fire fronts surrounding Sydney could get even bigger, potentially into Warragamba and Ludnam, even North Richmond. We're not going to get on top of all these fires until we get some decent rain. But for Lithgow tonight, it's just a matter of saving as much as they can. Chris O'Keefe, Nine News.